This is Charlie Flow World Sports Coach so Effie Jones. You guys have a 0-0 zero, zero draw. This tournament is still very alive. A lot of firepower tonight. You know, what, what are some of the reasons you think you guys just can't find the back of the net? Oh, we had a couple of chances, um, and I think it's the I would say the last push. Like, like you really wanna wanna score, and um, we um, yeah we had had some trouble scoring, but I'm still um, very happy with the with the game we had many changes in the in the um, in the team we had many young ones in now and in the second half we we I I changed again but but still we really had some good chances I, I think we played we um, played um, I say good football we we were the, the ones who were um, Was heißt denn das Spiel bestimmen? Um, genau, ja. Yeah. Yeah, after the 58th minute, because after halftime, notice after halftime, you really, about 58th minute on, you really ramped up. Is that something you talked about at halftime, really putting more attack into the second half? Yeah, we, um, we told the team that they could go a little more forward and, and be more active than, re, than, than to react. And, um, and, it, and it helped, but still we didn't score. So, just your thoughts on this tournament in general? You know, the She Believes Cup. You know, getting these powerful teams together. What does it mean for women's football getting these great teams together and exposing the game? Well, it's always great having such a good um, uh, teams that you're playing. Um, that's the second year, and playing against the U.S. team is always a great competition. Also, France and. England, so you have two um, two European teams that that we're playing against the European in the European Championship and the U.S. team. So um, I I think that's the best that we can play against. And um, when you ask me, this She Believes Cup is for women's football very important. I I think you can really uh, see it on. TV, you have many spectators here in the U.S., so I'm thankful to um, to have the opportunity to play against three world best teams. Yeah. Yeah, but it was different. I mean, at the last game, when we played the U.S. team, we were pretty much tired and not on on our normal level and um, that's what what we tried against France showing that that we're compact that we're good organized and that that we can uh, dominate a game and um, we all also knew that France's technical skills good fast players and so we uh, we try to defend good and I think that we did well. Um, we had some good chances also, but we just didn't score. So we have to change that against England then. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Bitte schön. Thank you very much. I'm sorry, I'm, I have to work on, on my English again, but I... Next time, next year. It was good. Next year. <laughs> next year. I promise it will be better. Look at that. Look at this. <laughs> Thank you very much.